Skeleton King will be the lane clear. I want you guys. And actually, that'll be great because I need to farm orbs anyway. So I want you guys on my team to really play the roam game. I'm going to do the specialist game. In fact, I'll type this to this guys here. So nothing... Skeletal Swing restores per enemy hit. That could be interesting. I don't know if I'll have enough mana issues, though. I never really have too many mana issues on Skeleton King. I think let's still do reanimation, because we still want our orbs. And I'll go around clearing lanes. I guess I will need level 4 before I can really clear lanes any better than my normal one. But still, let's try it out. Specialist Lior. Let's see if it's a thing. Royal Focus. At level 4, increasing my Skeletal Swing damage by 50% after it's used. Sadly, it doesn't reduce the cooldown, so we'll be able to, to Wraith Walk much, much faster than we can actually put out the Skeletal Swings. But we'll see what happens. We got Diablo 2 to farm off of. So that'll be good. Ariel got the way. Get out of my way, Ariel. All right, I'm reporting to lane. I got orbs. Actually, well, we can help these guys get this orb here. There we go. Yeah, Ariel's pretty low health. Going to the top. What a map to try this out on. Dream of the Spider Queen. Get some gems. Let's go. Let's go visit bottom. There's another orb. All right, I'm out. Maybe I should have stuck around, but I've got specialist business to do. In fact, let's go ahead and practice what we'd be doing level four. The ghosting in. And I guess on this map, we should just aim to get our gems first. And the front line will fall naturally. And then we can switch it up. All right. Job's done. Zool is in my way. Two in the bottom, so this fight should be going okay for them. Alright, on my way bottom. Nope. I made an Arthas friend. <laughs> uh, nice name, Arthas. Real nice. Very medical in its vulgarity. Oh, isn't this a gentleman's look? Okay, no, no, he's gonna break the gentleman's agreement we had. Look, man, we were both trying to get, both kind of trying to get gems here. No need to disrespect. I guess we'll hang out here for a little bit. Let's see. Well, there goes Zul. I'd be very surprised if he didn't turn around and deal with me, but looks like he's gonna let it go. 16. In the bag. Alright, let's do Royal Focus. We take no damage. Four second cooldown on that. 50% bonus to the skeleton swing to follow. I'm fine if Zul doesn't learn his lesson on bone prisoning me. Now we're gonna need to royal focus this one. Let's see how it does. 407 damage. Not mind-blowingly incredible, but does add to it. Let's see what the damage looks like without an increase. Actually, no, we have we have royal focus. Oh, <laughs> we both missed. All right. Pardon me, sir. No, no, there's, there's no time for this. 37. All right, I think I'll just go top off. We're running out of mana anyway. So looks like we will need the level 16 renewed swing. That's a long time to wait until you can clear a 
lane almost instantly, but we'll see how it feels when we get there. Could be good. There are so many good Leoric builds, though. That Drain Hope one is just the stack. It's so powerful. Granted, if you miss your Drain Hope, you're, it's a pretty big investment. guys might try to stun juggle me. Oh, yeah. There we go, that's fine. Well, it certainly takes care of the skeletons. Ah. Yeah, quite a bit lower damage without the royal focus. We got it, we got it. Nice shot. So here, big lanes later on. Want to make sure I can take care of them. Let's increase the range in this specialist Leoric build. And I still need orbs, so no need to worry about that. In fact, let's get me turned in. I got another 10 again. And I still get the bonus. I, okay, cool. I still get the bonus damage even if I take damage during it. So that actually does make up for me using it wrong in some cases. Not like we want to, but it might help. I mean, we can just do a little jitter here. Help clear that out faster. Still not down to one auto attack, though. Which is what I'm really looking for if we have to make any sort of deal about it. And then only last... Okay, we're gonna have to use it as soon as we think of it. Oh, poor Morales getting dogged. Still, oh, range can do it. I'll go get some orbs in the middle. Gotta keep stacking, even with this this focus on it. I still feel like I'm always lagging behind, but we're technically doing about two a minute, which isn't awful. I don't think I change anything at 10. I mean, I'm definitely a little more squishy. Should we do have... Hmm, we do have a mosh pit, don't we? But we also have the double burst. No, no, let's just entomb. Dodging that scythe. Let's kind of get off cooldown, though. You are sort of lagging behind. All right, let's park my body back here so it doesn't take any incidental damage. Oh, sounded like there's a mosh pit down there. And for Entomb here, I'll have to watch the cooldowns of my burst to make sure they can actually follow it up. Otherwise, we'll just be dancing in the dark. Ah, oh, this is fine. So he might have seen that I used my Wraith Walk. Let's think of that. Maybe he can kill me. But I actually had it on a four second cooldown. I think I actually have the mana to Wraith Walk and do the skeleton swing. Well, I'll just do a little dance. Come on, mana! There we go. Oh, one more whip. Where are you off to? Okay. There we go. Okay, that took a little bit of work. Oh, no, no, no. Now there's a giant thing right here that we should deal with. Oh, and me out of mana. Okay, we'll kill the spider. We'll go get mana. And then we'll come back in the lane and clear it with my staff.
Oh, well, you know, that does block his exit, technically. No, no, it did not. Well. Oh, well, I've got lots of gems. It's good for that, but top fort's gonna fall. Oh, oh overinvestment. You know, maybe, maybe I do want to do the level one level one mana if I'm doing this. Yeah. I mean, certainly it does play in. I am getting lots of orbs, so it's not focused on clearing the lanes, but mana thirst could be pretty good. Feels kind of silly like that chromey bronze towns business where you gotta shoot a shoot a sandblast that does nothing so your next one's empowered. Here, I guess we... Oh, well, no, if we're doing lane clear, we do Burning Rage, right? Oh, wow. You guys are doing hot down there. We're sitting on a couple gems. It does take me down to one auto attack to clean up. With the Burning Rage enabled. So it's only 38 spell damage. Sadly, I'm out of steam. Oh! Oh, well, you know. Alright, so we need to get ourselves the mana at level one. How fascinating. All right, I gotta go back for mana here. Interesting build, though. Let's see the outputs of Ariel at the moment, based on our team comp. So we got Ariel, Ariel. Ours is putting out quite a bit more. And how's the damage? Well, our damage is on top. They're double tank, so Ariel wouldn't have as much to feed on. Here we go, renewed swing, 50%. Second cast within three seconds. Should be enough to instantly clear something. Not like we're kind of falling behind at the moment, but... Yes! Ah, the warrior's in front. But the back falls, right? That's important. Those are the ones that do the damage anyway. Get enhanced by Zagara. Oh. Should be okay. extra swing, wouldn't I want slow maybe? I mean, that certainly would feel good, wouldn't it? To reapply a second slow. So the damage is decreased. Pyroblast in the face. Here comes Azul. Right into the bosh. Oh, right into the bosh. Right, so I should probably aim. Ooh. Poison hurts. I guess I'll get turned in. And then, what, I'll go farm top? I still haven't completed my darn quest. And I do miss out, oh, if I'm doing a laning build, I miss out on Fealty Unto Death, which is my other way to get mana, so I do need the level one, don't I? Should've done my walk. Right, I assume they're coming for me. Really dominating the map, though. There's nothing really Ariel can do to top me off, is there? Now, nah, let's go. We'll go hit a well. 
Jeez, poor Aria. But she doesn't have the damage on her side to, to make the group happen. All right, well, I think we can... Well, you know, I'm still not done with my quest, technically. We should probably go clear this out. Don't help me! Don't help me! It's all mine! Your flame strike was worthless. That's <laughs> that's pretty hot. Yes. Granted, well, with the orbs, actually. Our man is going pretty well, but we did have a well underneath it. They're wailing on the core, aren't they? I should probably end the charade. Oh, poor girl. <laughs> well, I should have. I mean, we, we've assumed that Ario can res Skeleton King. And it'll be where he died, not where his ghost is. But if I'd known you were taking res, I would have, you know, gone and, I don't know, tried to solo the boss or something for you. I'm sorry we didn't get to experiment with that. Nice job, though. Nice job, everybody. Top siege damage. Yeah, I think we're gonna need... I think we're gonna need the man at level one to make sure the push keeps pushing. <laughs> 